welcome to e-learning and today in this video we are going to concentrate on lecture number 12 problems on stress and strain part 1 so in this we are going to learn problems on stresses in bars so there is one question given here a nylon string has a diameter of 2 mm Pulled by a force of 100 Newton. Okay. Pulled in the sense, this is tensile force. Determine the stress. So, what is the given data in the question? Data is nothing but first is force they have given that is 100 Newton. Diameter of uh, 2 mm. This can be written as 0 0.002 meters. Radius. Uh, they have been, uh, it, it will be exactly half of the diameter. So, 1 mm. So, this is the given data given. So, this radius you can, uh, uh, for your uh, need, you can find it out and keep in given data. Now, what we want to find is, uh, determine, they have said, determine the stress. So, we want stress. So, what is the solution? First and foremost thing, you have to calculate the cross section of, um, you know, the string, nylon string. So, how to find it? Cross section of a uh, nylon string, they have given the diameter, it means it is a circular, circular in cross section. So, the area of this circle the formula is given by pi by 4 d square, right? Or you can write it as directly pi r square. So, you may take it directly. So, here they, we, uh, we have used here pi r square, so m, uh, 1 mm, that is. Uh, 0 0.001 meter I have used so pi value is 3.14 or directly you can enter in the calculator pi by 4 into diameter square so the diameter is 2 millimeters or you can put it in 0 0.002 meters also so you will get an area of 3.14 into 10 raise to minus, minus 6 meter square okay so why it is 10 raise to uh, actually it is 10 not minus 6 it is 10 raise to 6 Yeah, yeah, it is correct. 3.14 into 10 raise to minus 6 raise to meter square. So, it is you can write this as you know in decimals 0.00003143314 meter square. So, first we, we need to understand you know stress. Stress is given by force divided by area. So, ratio of force to the area per unit area is stress. So, we know force is given as 100 Newton and area we have found out as 3.14 into 10 raise to minus 6. So, put that value and uh, put, it, put these values in the calculator. You will get 31.5 into 10 raise to 6 you know, Newton per meter square because load is in, force is in Newton and area is in meter square. So, Newton divided by meter square. So, unit will be Newton meter square. So, this is how you have to calculate the stress. Second problem taken here, a cord has an original length of 100 centimeter, okay, now it is in centimeter unit, is pulled by a force, okay, the change in length of a cord is 2 mm, okay, determine the strain. So, given data, original length is given by uh, L naught, okay, or L O, you can say, L to the suffix O, original length, you can say, 100 centimeter. And we know 100 centimeter is 1 meter. So, this can also be written as a 1000 millimeter also. The change in length that is delta L. We know the terms for change in length or deformation is given by delta L. So, delta L is observed as 2 mm extension because it is pulled, right? So, the cord was pulled and that is why the change in length is extension. So, extension in length is 0 0.002. Uh, meter or 2 millimeters. So now what we want is we wanted the strain. So small e for strain notation for strain is small e small letter e. So strain is given by what? The formula is change in length to the original length delta L by original L uh, original length L. So uh, the ratio of change in length to the original length is said to be strain. Now put the value of change in length. So both the values should be in one uh, same unit. 
so delta l is taken as uh, 0.002 meter and original length is taken as 1 meter so 0 0.002 divided by 1 will remain 0 0.002 so strain so see meter gets cancelled on so numerator and denominator right meter gets cancelled uh, on numerator as well as in denominator so strain will not have any unit so this is how you have to find out stress and strain for uh, such questions arrive in examination uh, which will arrive in examinations so this is the simplest uh, examples or problems we have taken in the video so you we are going to again take the combination of stress strain uh, elongation and relation uh, relationship problems in upcoming videos so stay tuned on this channel for further notifications and uh, upcoming videos subscribe the channel diploma in civil engineering pratik lohar so once again thank you